Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool. And today we're gonna to take a look at these Swan Lake 15 piece wrench holders. And that's individually, it holds 15 pieces, but it comes in a set of two, one kind of snap on green and the other black. And what I've got is a set of different wrenches in here to show you how these things work. This is basically a big flap that fits over the top for security, but these are also in there fairly tight as you can see here. And it allows you to fit in all kinds of different wrenches. As you can see, what I've done is put like my assortment of various wrenches. So I've got a 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14. And then I've got this double-sided 14 in the four-way. I've got a uh, 13 here. I've got a 12. I've got a flare nut wrench. This one size we got a 12 and a 10 here but i flipped it over so it would fit in you know with the angle here double sided you can see there are various wrenches in this and that's more organizational it's pretty solid lockup there is this handle you could easily just slice it off right here and here if you didn't want that sticking out um, and then you can see the height so it does fit in most drawers here I've got a traditional set of wrenches. This is a snap-on set of SAE traditional, um, these combination wrenches. Um, as you can see, I've got down to 5 16 on this end, way down to a quarter here. So you can see how these actually do fit in quarters. On this, anything above this point is not super secure, but close enough. Anyway, I also hang them. I've, I've set up a few in the garage with like Craftsman wrenches and, and I've got a few other odds and ends brand, brands. I use the black for SAE and the lime green here for metric. Now one thing is I tried to peel this off. I tried to, I thought I don't want to have to keep branding this Chinese made Swan Lake garden tools, which actually makes all kinds of stuff. So I tried to pry this thing off here. This is what happens. So I wish it came off a little bit easier. I'm not gonna spend the time scraping it down, but I like things a little bit simpler, so it'd be nice if it was just plain green. Anyway, these are about 10 bucks for a pair. Um, that's for two of them, one green, one black. There are lots and lots of wrench holders available. Nothing says these are the best, but they do seem to work quite well. They do have um, good wrench holding, like if I flip this over, you know, you can see they're in there nice and snug. They hold different shapes as, uh, as I showed here. So as far as organization, you know, it's, it's decent, especially for the money. There's no reason to spend a ton of, of, uh, coin on a expensive set of plastic wrench holders that are probably made in the same factory as these. But these are a pretty solid, you know, heavier plastic, nice and spring-loaded, as you can see, with these kind of engineered spring spots. I'll show you on this one, the way these hold these in. So, thought I'd bring those to your attention. That's what I'm using for this kind of stuff. And with that, dock out.